so it's off to work. You know, my self-talk used to be really bad in the morning. You know, I'd just tell myself, get a bitch, you gotta do this. And, you know, I was a drill sergeant on myself. Now, the first thing I do when I wake up, I say thank you. Thank you to my higher power. Thank you for giving me another day to to do better than I did yesterday, you know? Then I'll have to get my alone time, you know? Meditate. Get ready for the day. It's, um, it's crucial to my day because I have, um, I have serious anger issues that, uh, that still pop up, you know, and I got, you know, that devil on one ear and angel on the other ear and man, I'm telling you, the angel wins most of the time now, you know, but sometimes that damn devil just pops his head out, you know, and I act stupid and reckless, and it's gotten me into a, a whole bunch of shit, so now I'm trying to just do what I gotta do, man. You know, I get to go to work today. That's a good thing. You know, whatever you do, do it to the fullest. You know, at your job, man, work your ass off. Whatever job you got. You know, if uh, if 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 you love somebody, man, love them with all your heart. Love them, love them to death. You know. If you hate somebody, man, hate that motherfucker. You know what I mean? It's fucking hard as you can hate that person. Because that's, that's how life goes, you know? You got to do everything to the fullest. Don't, don't skip steps, you know? If you don't do it, I don't think the universe will will really bless you like it would if you do everything to the fullest, you know? Because when you're doing things half-ass, you get half-ass results in life and in, in whatever. I just wanted to come on here and say good morning, have a good day, you know, try to get you guys to uh, get up early. Watch the sunrise. It makes you feel good, man. Knowing that, uh, knowing that, well, for some of my people out there, you know, I know what you're going through, you know. First thing you do is reach for the pill bottle or you reach for your juice, man. And I hope all of you can one day stop that shit because. Waking up in the morning, not worrying about where I hid my drugs. You know, that's a that's a good feeling. All I need is a rock star. And maybe an apple. And I'm cool, you know. Or a banana. Probably a banana. I get more carbs out of a banana you know I'll have some oatmeal or something but for the most part I'm not a big breakfast guy you know but for all you people going through it man you know do what you gotta do I'm not I'm not judging trust me I'm not judging I've, I've been there I've done that you know but I know your pain I know how you feel you know, it's a, it's a hard living, you know, to have to worry about that shit every single day, even this <clears throat> lockdown, man, 
with the shit's clothes and all that, man. That, that would fucking worry me to death. Sad. But it's the way you got to do it. It's the way you got to do it. But if you ask me, I'd, I'd get off that shit. Get off it quick. Or not quick. Take your time and get off it. But just get off it. If you can't, you can't. You know, and some people got to stay on that shit their whole lives, and it is what it is. But uh, that's how I thought I was. I thought I was going to be on it for the rest of my life, but I got kicked out of the methadone clinic, and that was the best thing for me. So, um, basically, just do what you got to do, man. And everything you do, do it to the fullest, man. Because, uh, you know, today ain't, tomorrow ain't promised. There's some people that went to bed last night thinking they were going to wake up. They didn't wake up. There's some people today that think, you know, they got plans for tomorrow. But those plans won't be there because they're not, they're not going to make it. Every day ain't promised. So, live it to the fullest, you know. Go big or go home. Los vemos, mi gente.